I am super, super excited to share this one with you. So if you swing trade or even if you scalp, you can use this method, but I want to show you how to solidify partial take profit when you trade. Now, what I mean by solidify partial take profit is that when you're in a trade and let's say you are in profit by, let's say 50 pips and you want to close out some of that profit, let's say about 25 or 45 percent of that profit did you know that you can close that trade with well you can take profit without closing the entire trade that's called taking partial profit so i'm going to show you exactly how to do that now if you for example are in a swipe trade and let's say they send you an update you scroll to the bottom of the update and it tells you to take it tells you to solidify partial take profit i'm going to show you exactly what you would do even if you're not in a swipe trade let's say if you're in an iml tv swing trade through one of our educators i'm, I'm going to show you how you can do that as well too if you're already in profit now you can use this with scalping as well it would probably be more effective with the longer term trades but let's say if you are in a scalp trade and you're up like twenty dollars and you want to close out half of that and just secure ten dollars of it uh, you can definitely do that so basically, if you got a swipe trade notification, you would go to swipe trade, you would get the update, and then you would go to your MetaTrader 4 and do exactly what they tell you to do. So let's say that um, we're already in a couple trades. So let's just say these are the trades that we're in right now, okay? So let's say we're in Euro GBP and we wanna take half of this trade. Now, in order for you to take partial profit, you have to take so let's say, for example, I'm in Euro GBP and I'm trading at $1 lot size to secure half of this. So let's say one of them is at $5. So let's say if I want to take half of that, all you do is slide you, you uh, on the trade, you actually just slide to the left. So I have an iPhone 7 Plus. You slide to the left, you click the check mark, and then you have to enter a, you have to enter a lot size smaller than what you started with. So if I wanted to take half of this, since I traded at a dollar lot size, I could maybe secure, let's say I could do 0.05 and see it'll say close with profit $2.37. I could do 0.08 and I could close with $4. So you could do that. So I'll just close with, I'll close at that amount. Okay. So see how I closed part of that profit and now it's a little bit less. So now I'm trading at 20 cents a pip instead of a dollar a pip because I took partial profit, all right? And then when I go to my history, it's gonna show that is the profit that I took. Now this is a demo account that I'm demonstrating in. Um, so that's why I have a couple of trades running because I was hoping they would go positive so I could show you how to take partial profit. So I'll do it one more time just so that you're clear on how to do it. So I'll go to the other Euro GBP that's in profit by $4.74. You just slide to the left. Click on the check mark and then go to your lot size. Remember, you have to type in anything that you started. Um, it has to be less than what you started with. So let's say we just want to do 0.03. That would be $1.50. Or we could do 0.04. That would be $2.16. And then all I do is click close with profit. And it's still going to keep me in the trade. All right. The only thing is that when you take partial profit, it's now going to lower the lot size that you're trading at, um, but that's okay too. So I just think that this is such an awesome, awesome way to secure part of your profits, especially if you are in like a swing trade and that swing trade, you know, especially if you're, let's say if you're at 50 pips in profit and it's looking to take, take profit too, but you wanna just go ahead and close out some of that profit, I think that that is such an awesome way to trade. So just wanted to share this with you guys. I hope you find it helpful. Comment on this video if this made sense to you, if you found it helpful. If you have questions, I'd be happy to answer them. If you are not an IML customer and you're interested in swipe trades or receiving any of our signals or going through our education platform, there's uh, information in the description. You can follow that, reach out to us, um, go exactly follow how we have it laid out and it'll it'll direct you and give you everything you need so i look forward to hearing from you guys i hope you guys are doing well in your trading and i'll continue to share as many tips as possible bye guys